Well, sometimes I go out by myself and I look across the water. And I think of all the things what you're doing. And in my head, I paint a picture. She got the umbrella of God on. Shorty is a touch of She sold it to me, got gold. Yeah, shorty, she back with a beautiful star. I'm going to for sure check in with y'all later. <laughs> hey loves, I wanted to get on here and talk to y'all since I haven't talked to y'all all day. But hey, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Janine Bermay and I'm back again with another video. So as y'all can tell by the title and as y'all can tell by the previous clips in this video, it's my move in weekend for junior season. Let's get to that money, let's get to that money. Let's get I'm super excited, even though today has been chaotic, y'all. It's it's been chaotic. We gonna get into it, but I'm excited. It's my moving weekend. It's my junior year. I go to Grand Canyon University. It's my second year at this school and I have loved my experience so far. So I'm excited and also ready to get it over with. I'm honestly ready to get the move in, move out part over it, over with and just get to the, I moved in already and my dorm room looks cute and everything's just put together. You feel me? Let me fill y'all in on what's been going on today and what's going on this weekend. So today is today is Thursday, September 1st. I had a flight from Atlanta to Phoenix this morning at like 7 a.m. I had to get up at like 4.30 to leave the house on time, blah, blah, blah. The whole flight experience was rushed, y'all. Like, I, I kid y'all not, it was a 2 out of 10. And that's being generous. My mom was rushing me to get in the car, but the luggage wasn't in the car. She wasn't in the car. Why do I gotta be in the car, you feel me? So it was chaotic from the start of the morning. It was go, 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 go. Mind you, I came with my grandparents and my mom. We all sat in different seats because we all bought our tickets at different times. That is what it is. I ended up sitting by a guy who stunk. It wasn't even like a a stink, like a heavy stink, like, oh my goodness, you stink pee woo. It was such a mild, scent that I was taking like small breaths because I could not I I could not I ended up sleeping most of the flight and, and I ended up noticing that I'm taking big breaths while I'm sleeping and so I either got used to his stench or I was tripping but I think I just got used to it which is kind of disgusting now that I think of it we got to Phoenix my brother picked us up we went out to eat at this restaurant called breakfast club that food was really good I've had it before so I had to put my family on they loved it let me let me speed it up after that we went to Ross to go look for a white comforter because I haven't found a white comforter yet we didn't find it at the first Ross went to the second Ross found it by this time I'm tired my social media has ran out and it's like I'm around all my family I'm on my period day one of my period by the way sorry for the TMI but that on top of traveling on top of the Arizona heat I'm done I'm, I'm through take me out of the game coach mind you if you watched my last vlog you know that I sent my car to Arizona say so it'd be here when I got here tell me why I get in my car and it's dead so we ended up having to do the whole you know the engine stuff to get the car working because my brother left the light on in my car so yeah that was my day i'm honestly ready to rest because i've been traveling and i've been on go all day so i just kind of had to fill y'all in i feel like i could have made that shorter but what's the fun in that right now i'm outside my hotel i'm really going to take the rest of the day to just chill and prepare for tomorrow because tomorrow is my actual moving day i think my moving time is at 8 a.m and I have to really unpack everything that's in my car and also go pick up everything that's in my storage locker that I have here in Arizona. So yeah, 
tomorrow's gonna be really hectic and i have a whole bunch of stuff that i ordered for my room from amazon and walmart that i have to pick up from the mail room at school so it's gonna be very hectic but i'm going to try my best to make this a good vlog i can't promise this is going to be one of them calm aesthetic cute vlogs because this is the reality of me moving in i'm not gonna sugarcoat or bake it but i am going to try to make it enjoyable because i want to enjoy it so y'all can enjoy it i'm about to go into my hotel room take a shower rest i do know that we'll probably go out for dinner um don't know if i vlog that but i will definitely definitely see y'all tomorrow morning good morning y'all it is friday september 2nd it's a moving day get to that money let's get to that money it's 7 20 right now and my moving time is at 8 so i'm about to change into some clothes i already woke up did my hygiene and all that and we just had breakfast my parents and my grandparents are still at breakfast but we about to get to moving um we have a lot of trips to make because my car is really full so it's just gonna be me and my mom on the first trip then we gonna come back and get my grandparents when the car is empty i want to leave in like 10 to 15 minutes so i'm about to change and put on some leggings i'm excited to meet my roommates this year y'all this is a whole different topic that we gotta talk about but i'm just really hoping that my roommates this year like we can have like a good relationship and you know we can at least be friends and not just roommates, you know? Like, not just live together, but actually enjoy each other's company. Uh, so, yeah. <laughs> Hopefully that happens. Hopefully. Hey, vlog. So, it's 8.42 right now, and I just got to my apartment. Tell me why I've been on campus two minutes. Two minutes, and they already charged me $50 for a new key fob to get in and out of the building. Ridiculous. But we got our welcome. We got a little thingy we're about to go in and out the apartment so i'm gonna try to keep y'all updated probably set y'all up somewhere but just letting y'all know what we doing and this is what we doing <laughs> small. yeah this is small y'all we in here it don't got no roaches it don't stink ain't no white refrigerator it's 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 kind of small y'all i ain't gonna lie but we gonna make it shake we gonna make some shake <laughs> But it's better that you have your own space. Yes, it is better that I have my own space. I'm excited to decorate up in here, and that's what I'm excited to do. But we're moving some stuff into my closet. I already told y'all this hack. You pack your clothes like this, mm -hmm. and then you hang it on, and you strip the bag off. That's it. That's it. You don't have to make it complicated. That's it. So I'm back at the hotel and it's 11.31 right now. It's a lot going on. We're just chilling at the hotel till we go pick up stuff from storage and then we're gonna go back to my dorm room and set up everything. Cause y'all saw how me and my mom was trying to set up the bed. It wasn't working. Right now I'm about to order my scooter. If you go to Grand Canyon, you're going to want a scooter. It's a good investment. This bump on my chin. Mm -mm. Order this scooter right now and then we're about to head to the storage to do that i was just checking in with y'all letting y'all know what's going on didn't want to leave y'all out the loop so yeah cleanliness over here okay my grandma my mama they not gonna let me move in without disinfecting this whole building from top to bottom yeah they not pay me no mind but we're back in my room we're basically disinfecting the whole thing before we start moving moving things for real but we just got my bed up to how i want it no one's here but y'all look look at that like that room is so pretty. I haven't met any of my other roommates, but her door is open and that room is like so freaking pretty. Like she decorated it. I'm loving it, I'm loving it already. I'm loving it already. Cause you decorating your dorm, I'm decorating my dorm. We're besties, we're besties. I'm glad I don't got no basic roommates, you feel me? Yeah, this is my bathroom though. We got two sinks and then I got my own little medicine cabinet. She got hers. No, you know, you know the vibes. I'm sorry if this vlog is like all over the place. 
I'm trying my best, okay? You get what you get, and you better like it. <laughs> and you better like it. Why haven't you thumbs up this video yet? I don't know. Beats me. Hey y'all, so it's currently 4.07 and I just came from the mail room and got all these packages. Y'all should have seen them piling the packages on top of another. They were like, where does it end? But it doesn't because I ordered a lot. I have to go through and see if it's everything that I ordered. Walmart? Walmart. That's all I'm going to say because I ordered some plastic drawers to put my clothes in since my apartment room didn't come with any drawers. Does it look like some drawers could be in these little packages? It doesn't, but I'm about to open them and see what we got. It's kind of like Christmas day up in here because I got all these packages to open. Okay, so this is a whole bunch of Shein clothes. So, try on haul coming soon. This is my water bottle that I bought. Real cute, real cute. It's a half gallon, so it's smaller and more portable. So, this is my silk pillowcase, a sunset lamp for the living room, and then I bought this pink um, kitchen set. I bought a new iPad case for the new school year, and this one has a wireless keyboard on it, so it's better for me. I think these are my bed sheets that I ordered from Walmart. So this is my clothing rack, it's gold. And then this is like a jewelry hanger, and it's double-sided so I can put all my jewelry in it. What is this? Oh, my rug. This is my pink rug from Amazon. It's packed in here. So once it gets out, it's gonna like get bigger. I think this is just clothes from Shein. All right, y'all, so that was everything. This is another Shein box that I was sent. And then the other little random stuff I'm not opening because it's not important. I also got a mirror from Walmart. We're about to open that. So I'm gonna show y'all that and then I'm gonna go because I gotta figure this Walmart stuff out. Hey y'all, so it's day two of moving day. It's Saturday, September 3rd, and it's 10.31 a.m. right now. So we're basically in the room. We basically got everything in here yesterday, which took a lot of time. Got stuff from the mail room, and today we're, I'm hoping to finish everything today, or almost everything, except like, you know, the wall decor and everything like that. So that's the plan for today, and then we're probably gonna go to like Walmart and Sands, get like food and stuff that I need for my dorm. And yeah, this is my parents and grandparents last day here because they leave tomorrow. So I'm hoping to get everything done before they leave so I can get their help with everything. Right now, we're about to go put my little sheets in the dryer before we put them on my bed. I'm gonna get the bed done first because you know, that kind of sets the tone for the whole room. But yeah, just letting y'all know, I'm gonna check in with y'all a little later. All right, y'all, I feel like I haven't really had time to like sit down and talk to y'all for real, for real throughout this whole process so i'm gonna do that right now but i'm moving my car to the parking garage because i don't want to get fined for parking like right outside my building my moving experience like it's been good so far i feel like it's been kind of stressful a little bit but we're getting stuff done i think the heat on top of all the work we're doing like moving in and out it's been a lot i did just move some more stuff in but moving period is done like they no longer have people out there helping or anything i will say that moving last year was very hands-on it was only hands-on because i moved into like the freshman dorms and those were the only um spaces available and like there were freshmen and sophomores there even juniors who didn't get housing for apartments but i feel like they made it more fun and hands-on and whoa moving day last year versus this year they're like get your butt in the apartment and move in thanks but i'm not complaining because i really didn't want a whole bunch of people in my face but that is like a difference that i noticed from last year to this year so moving in your freshman year you should be really excited for them to be all whoa 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 gcu go loves loves up Time
Hey y'all, so it's 4.26 p.m. right now and I just got back to my dorm. My mom and my grandma are back at the hotel. So I'm about to get some stuff done before I meet back up with my family for dinner. But I'm gonna show y'all what we got done so far. Over here is still kind of a mess, but it's kind of an organized mess. And you know, you know. We got the bed set up as y'all seen. It's really, really cute. And it's gonna be really cute when I get like my posters up there. And then we got my closet. We got these two little things here and then my shoe rack right here. It's coming together, it's coming together. This moving thing, y'all, um, I wouldn't recommend. Stressful, like I literally hate moving in. Like I have to find a spot for all of this just for in eight months for me to find somewhere to put it so I can give it another spot next year in a different room. Make it make sense, America. I kind of want to put up my LED light, but at the same time, I want to get some stuff off of the floor before doing that, so we we gonna see. I have some clothes in the suitcase that I just brought from the hotel, so we gonna fix that up, and we'll see where we're at in a minute. I literally just unboxed this perfume, and it smells so freaking good. It smells like pink sugar. Um, that scent at the beauty supply store, the little perfume oil, this is literally the perfume board. Like, the way I'm gonna pair this together. I got this scent off of TikTok and I bought it off of Amazon. Y'all, it smells good. And they said it's long lasting, like three to five hours. Mm. I bought this off of Amazon. Literally, everything's gonna be linked in my storefront, but not now. When I film my dorm tour, everything will be linked in my storefront. All right, I'm about to play Bob the Builder real quick. Give me a second. All right, y'all, so it's 7.14 p.m. and I literally just got done. Ooh, but I just hit myself in the eye. I literally just got done putting my lights up and fixing some things. I still got some work to do, as y'all can see, but we put the lights up and they look so fine, like, yeah. Yeah, it's a vibe. My room's a vibe. Some of them girls that put LED lights anywhere. It could be their car, their closet, their room. They, my room a vibe. Like, nah, it's just the lights, babes. It's just the lights. She is me and I am her. I got this little corner set up. I thought that this was going to be a lot bigger than it is or a lot longer than it is. So I might get some more if I find them at the five below here, but Overall, this little corner is cute. I can't wait to hang up my posters here so it'll kind of look put together and also the white sheet covering up the bed and my carpet. I don't want to put my carpet down yet because my family's gonna come over and like bring like some stuff that we bought from Sam's today. Oh yeah, we did go to Sam's today by the way, but I didn't vlog that. I don't want them all over my new carpet with their dirty feet. So I'm gonna put my carpet like probably tomorrow or later tonight. But I still gotta organize this part and like find a place for everything to go. And I need to buy a curtain rod so I can hang my curtains right there. But other than that, my room should be coming together, y'all. Hey y'all, so it's Sunday, September 4th, and this is day three of my movement. Today I'm kinda adding finishing touches and getting like some stuff hanged up on my wall, but I had to go buy some stuff for that. I literally just got back to my dorm. I did a little bit of grocery shopping, like literally a little bit of grocery shopping, not a lot. But yeah, I'm about to put my groceries up in the fridge and then I think we're gonna go out. My parents and my grandparents are leaving today. I think I'm bringing them to the airport or my brother is. I don't know for sure, but we're gonna do that and then we gotta go to like Walmart and Dollar Tree to get some stuff for my dorm like finishing touches type thing. I don't think I showed y'all the progress on my dorm so far. Actually, I think I did, but when I walked in there this morning, one of my LED lights fell, so I'll have to tape that up later. But I'm gonna get these groceries and then we're gonna do that. Say bye. Bye. <laughs> I'll see y'all later. How was 
safe flight, Bagger Bar? Thanks for everything, dude. I don't know, no maybe, problem. maybe next year. Yeah. Alright. God willing. No. Look at them walking to their flights. Y'all, it's low key like just hitting me that moving is done and the school part of college is starting. Like, that's not clicking yet. Just dropped off my grandparents and my mom at the airport. Their flights are like three something. It's 12 50 right now. I have to go to Walmart to pick up my prints. Um, and I think that's the only thing I have to do. I'm gonna do that and then I'm gonna head to the dorm to put some final decor together. But yeah, I'm gonna see y'all there. Hey y'all, so it's 2.13 p.m. right now. I literally been running around the hot, hot Phoenix, Arizona. I just got back to my dorm and I picked up my poster from Walmart. I hope they look good. Yeah. Oh my goodness, I am so freaking pretty. Yeah, yeah. I was kind of expecting the pink to be a little more pink. But it's okay. We can deal with it. We can deal with it. So this one, y'all, I'm super excited about. Um, I got this idea from someone on TikTok. It's like my name in the dictionary, but I made my own version up. My own description or, yeah, whatever it's called. But, yeah. It says Jadeen and then how to pronounce it, J Dean. Proper noun. Um, yeah, and it says a young woman of God, a beautiful, hardworking, multi talented individual. Let's go A businesswoman, content creator, entrepreneur, and more with a creative mind used for God's glory. She enjoys the simple. <sighs> she enjoys the simple things in life and enjoys them with the ones she loves the most. Or alone, because y'all know me. I can spend my time alone and enjoy it. She is passionate about the things she loves and aims to enjoy life to the fullest. And I feel like this will be a great reminder of just who I am and what I do and who I do it for above my bed so yeah i was gonna get pink but i didn't know how it was gonna look so i just got black and white to make it look like a lot more professional hopefully it doesn't throw off the things in my room so far two out of two good and then i got this y'all i look so good y'all the short hair era was giving like this picture makes me want to cut my hair back to this length but i'm gonna let it grow out or whatever or whatever don't hold me to that got my gold frames i'm about to put everything in there they got scratched up on the way here i hate that for them i got this phone mounting tape from the dollar store this holds really well i did like some cloud mirrors in my room last year and it held the mirrors up pretty well so i know it's gonna hold these up pretty well above my bed for the sake of how long this video is already gonna be, I'ma come back when it's done. All right, y'all, so it's a couple hours later. It's 5.49 and I'm done basically fixing up the room. This is what it's looking like, y'all. It's so pretty. Like, of course I'm pretty, so it's pretty because it's me, duh. But look at this. So here's me and then there's the little description of me and another picture of me and y'all this is literally how I envisioned it to look and I feel like once I get my white thing to like cover up the bed and then open up my rug it's gonna be really cute and then I got this sign that says love. How cute like how cute is this? Please do not play with my interior design. Don't play with my interior don't play with my interior design skills. And I put up some things on my wall, but that is all that I'm going to show y'all of my room. In this video, just for the sake of one, this video being too long and two, a dorm tour is coming. we will give you an apartment tour and a room tour, so y'all definitely be ready for that. Turn the post notifications on so you can be notified when I post that. But honestly, y'all, the room's coming together, the apartment's coming together. I'm loving it. And I'm glad my roommates are into like interior design too because everything's gonna look put together, you feel me? My last roommates, we don't gotta talk about that. I still do have like a couple things to put up. I do have some stuff that's coming in. Again, Walmart, count your days. Cause there's so many things that weren't delivered to me and I paid for it, so why wasn't it delivered? And why can't I track it? Actually, I need to get on the phone with Walmart. Yeah, I need to put that on my to-do list. But y'all, that is the end of this video. I really, really hope that y'all enjoyed it. I definitely enjoyed filming it, even though it was kind of stressful. I really hope that I got good footage and I'm sorry if it was all over the place. It's my first time filming a move-in vlog and trying to move in at the same time. But like and comment on this video and subscribe to the channel because if you're not a J-baby, what are you doing? What are you doing? Join the family.
But I will see y'all in my next video. Bye.